Hey, it's Ken Krill with iBoostify SiteWrap, and I have got a great little strategy for you that will make your life a bit easier and hopefully a lot more fun. Let's jump over to SiteWrap and I'll show you what I mean. When you create a wrap, you have an opportunity to name your wrap, right? You name, you name the page title, then you put in the wrapped URL and the banner link and so on. Well, you can name the page anything you want. So if you have a relatively short URL like iBoostDubai.com or something else, you can now effectively make your page serve as a link shortener. So you don't have to have a really long um, uh, wrapped name like this, for example, okay, where I've got Seth Godin blog, for, for example. I can have it as SG, SGB, right? And so it'll be iBoostDubai.com forward slash SGB. And then the wrapped URL could be the rest the rest of the page or my JB Zoo link or whatever else I'm doing. Uh, there it is, Seth Godin blog. So I'm wrapping Seth Godin blog, but calling it SGB. All right. The rest of the, uh, and, and what you would do is if it's already a wrapped page, for example, or even not a wrapped page, if you're just using it as a link shortener, make your your banner link URL zero. Okay. Make your top image zero. All right, make your image height zero because you're not going to be using any wrapped image. You're just going to be using it as a link shortener to change the, the name of the page. Yeah, you still want to do your retargeting script, okay? But what that does is it gives you a wrapped page uh, that, for example, our, um, our iBoostify.com is a wrapped page. I'll show you right here. iBoostify.com is ClickFunnels page. It's wrapped. There it is, okay? Um, so... Right now, I can tell it's wrapped because there's a little border here. And when 2.0 comes out, you won't see this border. It'll all go away. It'll be seamless. Um, so anyway, this is a wrapped page. So currently, it's the, it's the uh, landing page on our blog. But it could be iBoostify.com forward slash 123, 1234, whatever it is. You create the page name, and anything else that comes underneath it is your own creation. So consider using SiteWrap. Where's the page I had here? Consider using SiteWrap as a link shortener for your own stuff any way you like. So that's, and that'll save you the money. You don't have to buy any other kind of link shortener uh, that is on the market right now. So enjoy, happy link shortening, happy wrapping, make today fun, and let's have fun together. Bye.